Hello and welcome once again to Victorian Snippets. As the table has been set several days in advance, it's time to direct our attention to Victorian housewives. Monumental task of planning the menu, ordering and shopping for the needed ingredients, and actually cooking and baking the feast. Luckily, she had Godie's Ladies Book and that's a popular woman's magazine of the times, to guide her decisions as to acceptable menus and cooking tips worthy of a Thanksgiving feast. The main course, the turkey, had to be ordered at least two weeks in advance to give the butcher time, ample time, to order from his sources, usually local farmers. Once that was taken care of and the price had been haggled over. Dry goods as well as root vegetables could be purchased at the general store. The next stop for this busy housewife was the fishmonger, where she would order her clams, oysters, and whitefish. All the fresh ingredients had to be picked up the day before the feast to, to ensure freshness. You know, nothing worse than week old fish or oysters. According to the magazines and guides, the dinner should be composed of several courses and an array of tasty side dishes. One suggested menu included oysters on the half shell, brown bread tartines, celery and radishes, clear soup with grated cheese, fish fillets with hollandaise sauce, potato balls, cucumber salad, roast turkey, sweet potatoes, turnips, and cranberry sauce, plus a green vegetable if available, such as maybe green beans or Brussels sprouts. The dessert course included fruits, nuts, pumpkin or mince pie, cider, and coffee. No wonder they had to start cooking several days in advance. Good thing they had two stoves for that too. The baking could be done two to three days in advance and the vegetables could be scraped and placed in pots. The soup could be prepared and later reheated and the day before, the turkey could be put in brine and the roasting pan prepared. The poor housewife could then collapse in a heap until the next day when she had to rise at the crack of dawn to roast the turkey and deal with the other fresh dishes such as the oysters. Luckily, Thanksgiving only comes once a year. See you next week.